Simple science. What are forces? A force is a push or a pull. You can't see forces, but you can see their effects on things. They can speed things up, slow them down, make them change direction, or make them change their shape. Forces are measured in newtons, a unit named after Sir Isaac Newton, who discovered that weight is the force of gravity that pulls objects down towards the center of the Earth. The force of gravity. Is what keeps things stuck on the ground, no matter where they are on the Earth's globe. If it wasn't for this force, objects would float free like astronauts in outer space. The weight of an object can be measured using a force meter, made from a spring balance, while an arrow can be used to show the direction of the force. Gravity is just one of a number of forces that can act upon an object. The force of magnetism can pull things made of iron or steel towards a magnet. The force of friction can slow an object down when it rubs up against another surface. You can measure this force by pulling an object attached to a force meter across smooth and rough surfaces. The force of friction is what creates grip that stops us slipping. Air resistance. Is a force that can slow down a moving object that has a large surface area. In the case of a man parachuting to the ground, there are two opposing forces at work. The downward pull of gravity is counteracted by the air resistance created by the parachute, slowing the man's descent. Another way to counteract the force of gravity is to place an object in water. The buoyancy of objects in water is a result of the upthrust of water that acts in the opposite direction to the downward force of gravity. When forces act in equal and opposite directions, they cancel each other out. We can see this with the force meter when it is used to measure weights. The spring stretches until the downward force of gravity. Balances the upward pull of the spring, trying to return to its original coiled state.